This panel shows us a trick to single-handedly lift the whole planet Earth, and it kind of works. Levers are an amazing invention to lift weight using less effort. Everyone uses levers in everyday life. A can opener is a lever. A seesaw is a lever. A classic balance scale is a lever. If we grab one of those, put one kilogram on one end and two kilograms on the other end, everyone knows the heavier end will tip down. But this only happens if the arms are equal in length. If one arm is longer than the other, a light weight on the longer end can lift a heavier weight on the shorter end. If we add more arms and shape them into a circular form, we get the very gears used in cars. Give me a lever long enough and I will move the world. This is what Archimedes, the ancient Greek mathematician who studied levers famously said. In the past, train cars were so heavy and yet they could be moved by a single guy using a long lever bar. In theory, if we have a very long lever, we can use a longer end to move very heavy objects to the other end. The equation of the lever is simply force 1 times distance 1 equals force 2 times distance 2. So the question we ask ourselves, how long is the lever needed to lift planet earth? Using the equation shown earlier with a person pushing down using 1000 newtons of force and planet earth being 1 meter away from the pivot point, we find that we need a lever about 6 times 10 to the 22nd meters long. That's roughly 6 million light years, about 390 billion times longer than the distance from the earth to the sun. Very scary number. And to continue on this, we need to find how much distance we would actually move earth if we had a rod that long. With 1000 newtons of force applied over a 1 meter movement, a person could move earth vertically about 1.6 times 10 to the minus 23rd meters. That distance is actually smaller than a proton. But instead of building this impossible lever, you could just jump. And that would move earth roughly the same tiny distance through newtons through a law. Even though after landing back down the movement would be cancelled out, but that just means you did it twice. 